you won't believe that this is 100% FMMPEG which I did. So there is this video in this video which I'll show you later and it's 100% FMMPEG. So let's start the story first. So one of my friends last year sent me this video and this video got stuck in my head because of the idea. So the idea is written in the title one second every day senior high school. I really liked it. So what I did is I wanted to do something like this but I don't have such an interesting life. So recently I was watching this channel and suddenly this idea hit me again some of the shots of the channels were really good so what i did is every uh, so i was binge watching it uh, this channel uh, one night while writing some code so uh, every time i liked any scene on any shot so i just wrote down the id and then the timestamp so i did this for more than 50 videos so the list was like more than 147 entries and the timestamp were different obviously and the ids were different so after doing all of this just make a youtube link out of it and then you can use ytdpl and just get the best video and you can just get the url okay so now if you just don't put this get url it will download the video but if you put the get url it will just give you the download link and it won't start the downloading which is quite cool because now i can just give this uh, as an input let's make a variable out of it ytdpl and this input and after that let's put next line ss for like the starting timestamp which we which i saved in a file and after that uh just timestamp which is three second and give the format mp4 and out.mp4 if i press enter so i did this for the entire list and let me show you how i did this for entire list so suppose if i have some lists so i'll read uh the timestamp ts and the file name or sorry id and after that uh you can just use this like ts and id and don't forget to put two and then done and suppose if there is some file ts.txt so i don't have that file now but by using this command you can get the timestamp and id so in the above command which i just run you just have to change the ts and id so here uh, the id will be this thing and the ts this timestamp will be this thing all right so that's it so after doing this if i show you the video out.mp4 so this is just three seconds okay so by doing this i made a collection in my pc of the shots basically so let me try to show you i don't know if i have it so let me ssh into my pc so my pc is uh, mundus so mundus ip pro all right so yeah so this was the result basically i i can't show you the video because i just ssh'd into it but uh let me just show you so it's like a 5 5 mb or short clips basically all right so let me exit out of this after doing all of this uh i have this notes here so you can just concat every video and you can just replace the audio but after concatenating i actually did some f uh, kdn live trimming which was not really required but i did this and here why replace audio just to put some music so now i'm going to show you that video so you can see it and Trust me, if you send it to someone, he won't believe like it's 100% FFmpeg, but it is 100% FFmpeg.